Two weeks away from the special election in Ohio, voters will have the chance to decide the fate of issue one, which if passed would make it more difficult to amend Ohio's constitution. Behind the scenes, though, it's a major undertaking and Hamilton County alone still needs about 500 poll workers to make sure things run smoothly. I'm here with the director of the Hamilton County Board of Elections, Sherry Polin. Thank you so much for coming in today and you need to get the message out there. We need poll workers. Um, I said 500, you know, as of when today? As of end of day yesterday, that's correct. We still okay. need about 500. So we filled 72% of our position, but there is still a need. Okay, and that's that's really important, especially we're just two weeks away. So trying to fill 500 positions, how are you encouraging people to come out volunteer, but it is a paid position, so it's not even volunteering your time. That's correct. It is a paid position. Poll workers make anywhere from $181 to $218, depending on their position. Managers make a little more. Um, it's a very rewarding experience. It's not a difficult job. We know it's a long day on election day, but uh, we have plenty of support. We have a training program. Um, and you know, this would be a great election to come out for your first time. Yeah, and talk a little bit about that training program. If someone at home right now is listening, saying I could use a little bit of cash, uh, how does this work? Where do I need to go? What's the process? Sure, the easiest way to apply is to go to our website, votehamiltoncountyohio.gov, click on the poll worker button, apply now. Or you can give us a call at the Board of Elections at 513-632-7000. We will schedule you for a training class. The training classes are at the Board of Elections headquarters in Norwood. We offer those classes mornings, afternoons, evenings, and Saturdays. So there's a class that will fit anyone's schedule. Yeah, youth at the booth is what we're taking a look at as well. And people are going, wait, what does that mean? You don't have to be able to vote in order to be a poll worker. That's correct. 17 year olds in Ohio can work the polls on election day and we've had an extremely successful youth at the booth program. And what's great about this election is most schools will not yet be started on August 8th. So if you're 17 year old, come on out, work the polls for us. You know, it's a great thing to put on your resume. And when you say working the polls, you know, some people may be like, okay, what's gonna be my task? What am I gonna be doing? What are some of those things? Thank you so much for bringing that yeah. up. The poll workers will go to their assigned polling location on the night before election day, on Monday night at 7 p.m. and work with their fellow poll workers to set up the polling location. Then they come back on election day at 5.30 a.m. Uh, because the polls open at 6.30 a.m. and they check in voters. We have tablets that has the database of all the registered voters in the county. So they make sure that the voter provides the uh, acceptable form of ID. They check them in in the tablets, give them their ballot and instructions. So again, it's not a difficult job. And we actually have troubleshooters out in the field that can be there at a minute's notice if anything does occur on election day. And we also have a help desk staffed at the Board of Elections headquarters dedicated, again, just to answer any questions from poll workers that may come up on election day. And you don't have to live in Hamilton County to apply, or do you? You do have to live in Hamilton County okay. in order to work for Hamilton County Board of Elections. But I'm sure there's other boards that may need um, poll workers on August 8th too. So if you live in, an, in a county outside of Hamilton, contact your local Board of Elections. That's some good advice. Thank you so much, Harry, for coming in. We appreciate you taking the time. Uh, every uh, one can obviously get behind this, whether you live in Hamilton County or other counties as well. Early voting is available at the Hamilton County Board of Elections office on Smith Road from 8 a.m. until 5 o'clock today through Friday this week. And uh, Sherry, again, thank you so much for coming in. We appreciate it. Dan, we'll send it back to you. All right, so here's a great